Hi, my name is Emily and I work here at PGACO as an online QuickBooks specialist. I am an advanced pro advisor and I hope that this video answers any of your questions or queries you may have. If it doesn't, however, there will be a link at the end of the video taking you to my Find an Accountant page. Here you'll find reviews from some of my current clients and you can get in touch with any questions or queries you may have. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe to this YouTube channel for any future updates and new videos. Thank you very much. In this video I'm going to show you how to allocate billable expenses to customers within QuickBooks Online. A billable expense is an expense a business has incurred which the customer has agreed to pay for. For example, a business may incur an expense for train fare to attend a meeting with a customer. This customer has agreed to pay for this train fare. So first of all, you will need to turn on billable expenses in the settings in QuickBooks. Select the company cog and then click on account and settings. Under expenses, make sure the make expenses and items billable box is ticked, as well as track expenses and items by customer. Once this is done, click save and done. To create a bill, select the plus icon on the top right hand side of the screen and select bill from under suppliers. In this example, the supplier is going to be Southern Rail and I will date the bill for the 1st of December. As it's train fare, it will go to a travel account and I'll put a brief description in here. So for the meeting on the 1st of December, The amount of the train fare was £50, and as it is public transport, it is going to be zero rated VAT. As we said, this expense is billable, so we're going to select the billable box, and the customer there, the meeting I attended was with Insure Limited, and they are the ones that have agreed to pay it. Once I'm happy with all the information, we will click Save and Close. Now when we go to create an invoice for our customer Insure, you will see that QuickBooks will recognise that they have an outstanding billable expense. It will prompt us to add this in the right hand side col column. Simply click add and this will be inputted into the invoice. You can add other items onto the invoice if necessary and send to the customer as normal.